In the next few minutes, I'm going to share with you how to survive family parties without a flare up or offending your relatives. For those who don't know me, hi, I'm Holly Fowler and I help Crohn's and Colitis Warriors achieve remission and get back to doing the things that they love. And because I know so many people struggling with IBS and IBD and other stomach issues really stress over attending family gatherings that they're not hosting, that I've created a guide just for you, just for this. It's all about how to eat outside of your home without causing a flare up. Want it? Just drop a line to me below in the comments and I will send it over to you as a gift for me to you for watching this video. No opt-in, no email required, just a thank you gift from me to you. I hope you enjoy this video. Tip number one for surviving a family gathering without causing a flare up is to offer to bring your own food. This makes you look generous rather than a difficult guest and it makes you feel safe knowing that there are, is food at the party, at the gathering, that is safe for you to eat. It's a win-win on all sides. Secret number two to surviving family gatherings without a flare-up is to talk to the host ahead of time. Ask, if, ask what the menu is, and also most hosts want to know if there are any dietary concerns for any of their guests that will be attending the party. So this way you can be proactive and let them know of any dietary needs that you have, ask about the menu, and this would be a great time to refer back to secret number one and offer to bring a food that will both help the, the host and yourself knowing that there will be safe foods there. And secret number three to surviving family gatherings without an IBS or IBD flare is to simply eat before you go. If you, if it's an unknown situation, if you don't know what the menu is or their accommodations, simply eat before you go. This way, this will keep the hanger at bay. Trust me, I know this from experience. It'll keep the hanger at bay if in the event that there is nothing that you can eat at the party. You can also bring a snack. If you don't know what the menu is gonna be like, bring a snack so that you can eat it during the party in the event that you aren't able to eat any food at, at the party itself. And there you have it. Now you can attend family gatherings this summer, stress-free and without fear of a flare-up and without offending family members. So as a thank you, because I know so many people with IBS and IBD struggle over the stress of having a flare up due to eating outside of their home, I've put together a guide specifically for eating outside your home with IBD. So to say thank you for watching this video, this is my gift from me to you. So just drop, um, drop a comment, below this video and let me know you're interested and I will shoot it over to you. No email, no opt-in, nothing needed, just a gift from me to you. Thank you so much and enjoy the guide.